Greetings everyone, what about up? It's me again, Tim Prime 1, with the final part of the, um, of the videos that I've been trying, I've been wanting to do today so far. You all have gotten to see, um, um, what's his face? Um, Ultra Striker, I think? Um, um, oh, wait, 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 Striker Menace. Striker Menace, along with, along with the, uh, along with, the armor upgrade kit. So we're going to go ahead and take a quick look into the armor upgrade kit. I think I forgot to push this in to make it look nice and flush, if possible. Hang on for a second. Okay. It's like that once I want to. Like neither side wants to go on in. There we go. There it goes. Got it all done up with. Now this is the final component right now. This is going to be probably the final video review for the day. I was very lucky enough to try to get it this far right now. But yes, with the striker mask right here, the uh, the not striker mask, but with the um, fans hobby, fans hobby. Am I right? Am I right? Fans project. Fans project armor upgrade kit for. This guy right here. Now, I'll say this: the fists do not go into this one right here. Do not go into this one. Uh oh, hang on for a second. I thought I heard a little something. Someone. Okay, now she is still asleep. So now, with striker man, with the um, striker man, with the armor upgrade kit right here, I will say this: um, this will probably have gone into like a different armor upgrade kit. And I did forget to mention in my previous video, I did grab it up off of BigBadToyStore.com, and I will say this about. The whole thing. I was expecting for this to be a bit shorter right here, just a just a just a bit shorter. Also, almost forgot you need to angle these down ever so slightly so that way they can stay flush onto the onto right there, so that you can have them to roll as freely as possible. Also, if you're wondering about this right here, these panels do not come back on up for once the, for once the armor is on this, it does not allow for this to transform back at all strongly because of all this right here so yes i really do like the armor upgrade kit right here it's really nice i really do like this right here i might just grab myself up um another classic optimus prime if possible if i can find them on ebay that will be smashing yes nigel thornberry if you guys guessed that correctly well if you guys didn't guess that correctly it's really nice, and you can see there is meant to be a trailer that can go right here. I think that's for the um, that's for like possibly a like a tr like I know that a third party company probably came out with a trailer, excuse me, for this guy right here. I might have to check online if possible, but yes, Re a really nice upgrade kit right here. And as well as for the fist, there was a upgrade kit over these fists, did go over the, the current fists. Because you didn't have to replace out the old fists for these new ones. I did I do like that one right there, so that way you could just keep those right there as much as possible. But there yeah. But I will say this it is really nice to have these bigger fists right here. I just do I do wish that they would have kept the other fists as well. Also, on this one, I accidentally somehow misplaced the other screw. So what I did was I placed the screw that goes down down here up here into the into the elbow so that way this would not get too loose at all but yeah really nice upgrade right here really nice uh oh uh oh uh oh boy my dad's calling i'll have to call him back later on but yes a really nice little upgrade right here really nice i really do like this right here you can see all the more detailing right there I really do like all that stuff right there. I like it all, including on the front end of the vehicle mode, especially right here with the little windshield. But they did not make it to where there's like an additional windshield right here. But I think it's because it would have broken off. But I think it would, it would not have like looked a whole lot. I don't think it would have looked decent enough right there. I do not think it would have looked decent because of how this whole assembly was supposed to be. Like right there, so yeah, that's so yeah. Oh, I'm just trying to tell you guys as best as I possibly can, because like if you look at right here, it would like it wouldn't like 
Like with this right here, there's no way they would have been able to make this a part of the windshield. So I understand why they had to do this, but still, it, it, it looks a little off, but it's still really nice. It, it's like an ignorable area that you can really look at this guy with. So yeah, really great looking vehicle mode right there. Really great looking vehicle mode. I really do like that right there. And before I go into any further details, I'm going to go ahead and place in Striker Manus for a size comparison because the others, like we all know of how he will size up to them. Yeah, y'all, y'all can see of how much bigger he is to Striker Manus. There you go. There you are. Yeah, R really nice. Yeah, you know, you can, I also do love the headlights up here. Also, the new grill section right up here. The lights up there all around and such really amazing detailing right there and if you want to you can possibly place those up right there <laughs> but those don't go up right there they still they'll stay right up right there because there's a little square area of where these things can like stay in right there because once this thing flips on up for the legs there's no way those things can flip on down but yeah really Nice looking vehicle mode, really nice. I'm still surprised at how long they made this. I'm, I'm surprised at how long they made this. I would have imagined them making this like probably a little bit shorter or something. What have you. And I have my brother calling me now. <laughs> oh boy. They're just going to have to wait a second until I can get this video done real fast. Because I, have to, I do have to head on out. Relatively soon, grab out my dad's stuff in the grocery food store, but only after my little girl wakes up from, from her second nap today. Yeah, really nice vehicle. Really nice vehicle. Love boarded details on him. Love all these boarded details on him right here. Just take a look at all that. Really nice. Really, really nice. So, uh, let's go ahead and get down to the transformation, shall we? Transformation is very simplistic. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. Also, I almost forgot to mention um, with these things right here, these are on a slider. You guys can extend them on up if you wish to do so. That way, like you can have to where those things are up, like this right here. Really nice, like that right there. And also, I just thought of this. You could probably, like, nope, you can't do that. I was about to say, you could probably just pull them on down for a battle mode, but you can't really do that yet. And I'm going to tap it back on tonight. Come on, just please work with me. There we go. There we go. But yeah, you guys can just fold them on down like that right there to like fire at any Decepticons that are coming at him. But yeah, you guys, you guys have it like that right there. I'm surprised at how like if like I thought you can put them on like that right there. Like I'm, like it shows that you're supposed to do them like that right there. Or if you want to, and I know these things will get in the way. You guys can just probably pop them up onto the. Other sides right here. Oh yeah, what the hey? Okay, you're asking for this. There we go. Had to force it on there. I just had to force it on there. I hate to do that right there. But yeah. There we go. There we are. Now let's go and pop those off right there for the transformation. Now the transformation process is a little complicated. Just a little complicated. Because I like grab here, you get to have these tabs really in alignment right there. And like all around right here, you just have to have everything into a proper alignment. That right there, let's go ahead and flip these on up real fast right here. And right up here, go ahead, take the scroll section. There, now it, it just simply pops right down there. Bring out. Now let's go ahead and bring up this right here. Bring this right here. Also, um, before I forget anything else, um, let's see. This, these do, these do need to come off on the sides right here. I got this on here before I can take it off. I know I can. Come on, just lift up right there. Just 
this thing right here, it's really complicated. Like, here it goes. There it goes. There we go. Got that right there. And I'm going to get this on this side too. There we go. There we are. Okay, yeah. Those are very complicated to get off if you go like. Those can be very complicated to get off until you can get really used to it. And I, know, and I just transformed this guy. Yeah, there we go so far. With those will become his weapons, much like with how uh, this top piece became his weapon. His, uh, it's a lot better in this weapon mode, but yeah. You guys get the whole thing. Go ahead and uncap this right here. Work with this thing right here. It's a little complicated. Oh, I almost, I almost completely forgot. You have to lift these things on first. So let's put this back in here. So yeah. Oh, I'm trying to rush right now. <laughs> I think I know why, but quite frankly, my family has got to wait until, I, until I'm fully ready to do things, especially if my daughter is taking her nap. And that came off. Yeah, little tab goes in that little tab goes in that little slot in there. So yeah, that's one thing I forgot to show you guys in my previous video. I have no idea why this thing is being so complicated now. Yeah, just we'll bring these panels on the back right here to help it make the process possibly a tad bit easier. The transformation gimmicks. Oh, come off now. Yeah, this thing's giving me a bit of a problem. I'm trying to get these videos done up with real fast because I have quite a few other videos I plan for much later on. Like for example, on my Energon Optimus Prime figure, I need to find the whole of him so that I can do his video review real fast. There we go. There we are. His wheel fell off. Yeah, I found out with these wheels right here, you just tab them on right there. And they'll just stay right there because of all, because of like these little things right there will go on to the wheel right there. So I can just easily align that right there. Easily align it. Oh boy. I'm just going to leave that off for a second. So I can really try to get this thing on here. So I can transform this more properly. Bring this on out right there. Bring this on down and around. Yeah, that's a bit, I'll admit, that, that's, that's pretty complicated right there. That, that's really, that's pretty complicated right there. I do wish they would have made a bit more of a clearance on those quests if I'm not. Well, I did just transform this guy one time. I just did transform him one time. So, yeah. There we go. Flip his feet on up right here. Tap that into place. Now, these wheels right here, they, you can rotate them up and down, but they go right up against. His legs right there. Rotate his feet on down right here. Right back here. We flip this on out so that way from last time become heels. Untab his legs right here. Also, I almost forgot one other thing. Um, this has a bit of you have to really pull this down and this side up. Here we go. Here we are. There we go. There we are right there. Now all we have to do now is rotate the entire assembly on top around. There we go. There we are. Now, what you want to do next is this. Go. I'm just going to go ahead and fix. Oh wait, oh, I did fix that panel. Yeah, I did fix that panel. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Rotate this on down. Now what you want to do is whenever you rotate this on down, go ahead and flip this forward right here. This piece will go right here and it let's see, this piece right here, all you have to do is let's see here. If I can remember correctly, you have to rotate you have to 
rotate this into the proper spot. Wait, there it is. There, there we go. There we go. I have it right there. Just gonna rotate this back on around. And there we go. Rest right there. And just make sure this does the same thing. Just gonna, I'm just gonna rotate it on up right here fast. Hang on for a second. There we go. Rotate this on around right here. And then you'll have to take this. Oh, bring it up right here. Voila. Voila. Rotate this on down and around. There we go. Take this. Rotate this on down. Bring this on around. There we go. You have the fist form. Same thing on this side right here. Take this. On around right here. Rotate so pull this up right there, pull that up right there. There you go, bring this on, on down right here. This is possible. There we go. R. Go. R. Now, what we're going to do up here is plain and simple. Fold these on over to the side. Rotate, we fold these on down. Take the head. Pull it on down. You can still see the old head, but the new head will come on over to take its spot. And there we have it. Voila. Voila. The brand new armored mode for Classics Prime. Really nice. Really nice armor mode. Gonna bring that up right there. So there we have him. So far with this transformation right here, um, there's one other thing I almost forgot to do, and it is on the back of his shoulders right here. Um, go ahead, and for a second, let me just adjust this right here. What you want to do with this right here is just go ahead, pull it on down, rotate it like so. Let's see, I can't fully remember how this is supposed to go onto him. Hang on, I want to check out the instructions. Okay, I'm about to do this the wrong way. I'm gonna do it like this right here. Shorter stacks up front. Like, and I know I just did this, but sometimes you can instantly forget. Sometimes. Sometimes. There's not one to clip on right there for some odd reason. Hang on for a second, I want to bring this one up right here. Do off camera again. Unless I put this on the wrong shoulder. No, I don't think I did. Okay, let's see here. I just want to try to do. I want to try to do it like this right here. Just place it on like so. Slide it on. Fold it on over. And this is somehow in the way. I don't know how. Whoops. Okay, I did not mean to do that. Maybe, maybe perhaps, um, I don't know if how to do this properly. Well, I do know how to do this properly because I did it earlier, but I'm not supposed to this is on the wrong way, on incorrectly, which I strongly doubt because that should go right there. Hmm. Yeah, I have everything corrected. I have everything corrected, but these are just not one to go in there properly. Hmm. I just realized it. I just realized it. Placing this right here. Okay, I'm going to take this right here. I'm going to go in the opposite direction this time. I 
think I got that right. I think so. No, I did not. I did not. Uh, let's see here. I think this way right here. Whichever way it is. Because this is supposed to... Because from what I could tell... Okay. Okay. Aha! I think I finally got it. Because, like, it looks as if this... Maybe I am putting on the right way. But then again, these are not, like... Okay, these are supposed to be facing back, but... But, yeah, this is like... This is how it's supposed to be, like, right here. That's how it's supposed to be, like. But somehow, it seems as if, like... Yeah, I think that's how it's supposed to go right there because of how the entire assembly is like right there. But yeah. There we are. There we go. There we go. And now for me to show you guys how to convert to, to configure these guys and he just fell. Uh, go ahead and rotate the guns around. Rotate this upside down. There we go. There we are. Rotate this all the way like so. Rotate on this side. Rotate this all the way around. Rotate this on down right here and rotate that on up right there. Take this. Fold. Here, fold this on over. You're supposed to fold this on over. I just did this earlier. There it goes. Do that right there. Rotate that around. Okay, that's accurate right there. Oh, wait, I'm forgetting, I'm forgetting. I need to rotate this gun on out right here. There we go. Now fold that right there. Rotate that around right down to there. Rotate this around right to here, and then fold that up and over. And so I will do the whole thing again on this one right here. Now I'll take this thing, rotate it, bring this on out, bring this on here. Now for this part right here, fold this on down right here. This way you can click a clearance, put this thing to come on over like so. Also I need to do that right there so I can put a little clearance right there. Rotate this on around, rotate, put that right through there, and there we go, so far, almost, 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 there we go. And also, do the same thing on this side, and there we go. Now this way, with the, with the armor upgrade on him, I can easily have it to where he now has two guns he's now pulling two guns and this came off again there we go yes there we are he is now ready for action ready for some action and i'll say this really nice looking armor mode still love what they did i love what they did Comparing these two with the gun, with the original gun, you definitely tell like they made it to where like this, like, like, like the one solid section right there comes off to form two guns instead of just the one gun. And they also made it to where the whole assembly right here does transform with him, except for the old fists, I do not know why. They reconfigured it to where you cannot take off the, to where you need to take off the old fist. I have no idea why they did that, but well, if I possibly can and down, later on down the line, I'll grab up the other armor upgrade kit for him and see if I can't replace out these old fists with the um, armor upgrade kit. But yeah, really nice, really nice on him. I really do like what they did right here. 
right here with them. And I never even remotely knew that you need, just needed to tab these on right here. I just thought you had to pull those off. But these are like an extension right there for the wheels. And the fists can come on out. Well, you can bring out the fingers and articulate the wrist a little bit. As much as needed. But yeah. Really nice. And they also give them really good shoulder cannons right there. Really nice shoulder cannons to, to where like... Well, kind of like well, more back cannons to where he, he can like fire missiles, including suppressive fire right there. Really nice right there. Also, real quick, I'm going to bring these guns on out for a size comparison real fast. For a size comparison. Here he is with, going to make sure everything is good to go in here. Striker Manus. They're about the same height. He's just a hair taller, just a hair taller than Striker Manus. But yeah, they're, they're about the same height. Very nice, very nice. Take a back on off right there. So yeah, really nice looking robot mode. And I will say this, on the habits where for his feet right here, you can just rotate his feet on up for some reason. I do not know why they have that going on right there. I don't know why, probably for packaging or something, but I'm not for sure why, because like these were for, the, I think it, I think it is for packaging. Come on. Yeah, that, that's not rotating around at all for some odd reason. This, this one will rotate around this one, that one, this one right here won't. I have no idea why, but yeah. They did a really good job. They did a really good job with this right here. You guys can still gra grab up the armor upgrade. I would definitely recommend the armor upgrade kit for him. If you're probably just trying to check out TS Source or Big Bad Toy Store, or if possible, maybe on eBay. I'm not for sure. Just trying to find this kit before it goes out of stock again anywhere. And if you all like this video, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel along with my along with my gaming channel and Wishmaker. Also check me out check me out on, on social media such as Facebook, Twitter, Twitter, Instagram, just one and so on. Leave me a comment in the comment section below. Until next time, I'm Timberman and I'll be signing off right now. So peace out.